To replace a probe assembly on a thermal probe gauging thermometer, remove the face plate by removing the screws from the face. Set them aside. Open the face plate up and disconnect the probe cable from the spring loaded connector on the board and remove it from the clip. Set the face plate aside. At this point you want to unwind the length of probe from the spool. Once the cable is unwound from the spool, you can pull the cable out enough to untie the overhand knot or you can simply just cut it loose. In this case we'll untie it. And then finish pulling the cable all the way out of the spool. Grab your new probe cable, fish it in through the handle, and install it through the grommet in the spool. I'm going to pull 8 inches or so out and tie an overhand knot for strain relief purposes. Then pull it tight. At this point, we need to strip the cable back to be able to get the conductors available to connect to the circuit board. We need to strip back about one inch of the cable insulation. And remove that. We need to trim away the inner Kevlar protection jacket to access the wires. Once the Kevlar is removed, you mushroom back the outer part of the coax assembly. Take a small screwdriver or similar. And it's helpful to separate these two. Like such. Strip back a little bit of your inner conductor. Now you have your two wires. Now grab your faceplate assembly again. We want to connect our wires to the circuit board. The terminal marked in black is for the braided shield, and the other terminal is for the white wire. install a faceplate.